everybody, my name is Kid Nerf, and today we will continue with The Walking Dead. We'll lock this place up good. <sighs> okay. So, hey, wait a second, what is this? That is plantation, isn't it? Is there anything here? Almost burp. Nice car, I guess. Stop. Oh, hey there. It's just the only option. Kitty? Need any help? Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean, in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I have no idea. No idea what I'm yeah. doing. At least you're honest. Shit. Better than I was when Duck showed up. You'll figure it out. How's your son, How's your son doing? Good, I think. kachi has got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. See ya. That's good. So you always have to talk with everybody, you gotta make, you know, make sure that they're in check. What I mean by that is that you have to talk to them, make sure, you know, build a relationship with them. So that way, the stronger the relationship is, the less of a chance they'll backstab you. Like for instance, you have so pretty hair. It gets lots of tangles. Imagine this, your best friend versus a total stranger. If you were, uh, let's say, if you're hanging off a cliff and you're falling and there are walkers all over, your best friend will most likely has a higher chance to go and save you rather than a stranger. A stranger will just run away. It has the more has more of a chance to run away rather than your best friend. So you have to build relations with them, a strong bond. So that's what I'm doing right now. So that way, if if I'm in a in anything too you know too difficult or hard to get out of. They'll definitely have my back. More of a chance to help me out. Give you that mm -hmm. Hey there, girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Hmm. Well, yeah. Obviously. So, you're good? Anyway, <laughs> it's almost pretty... like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? Uh, so, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back yeah. to normal. It can't stay like this. It can. No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. That's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. Mm. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people. You have to. You can't trust them. Some just, just. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You take a chance that if you pick one up, they might just stab you in the back of the head and kill your family. You just take the car and they'll just run off. Doc went through. You can't take a chance like that. Go back to the moment before you knew about all of this. Things have could all be providence, you know. Not what we saw. You just never realize when something is happening to you what you're being given. Maybe this will all work out. Your optimism is refreshing. Yeah. New. 
in these past couple days at least. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Things happen for a reason. I'm here for a reason. Listen, if I wasn't here, she wouldn't be worried, she wouldn't be afraid, you know, more afraid than usual, I guess. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? Still need a hand? I'm good. Maybe go check on my dad in the barn? Oh, I forgot. I totally forgot. Go. Let's see. Honestly, I'd say this is not a good survival place to survive. That, you should scrap down for metal, maybe, if you need it. You're going to have to look at things in a different way now. <laughs> See which one's worth more and which one's worth less for things. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until the boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all yeah. that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon, with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yep. Yeah, I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Well. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna wanna make it. Yeah, that's if true. If those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. What the hell is that about? Go! I'll get my gun! I'll take that pitchfork, dude. <laughs> I'm gonna try to save somebody who can help. Stupid kid, see what I mean? I don't know how old that kid is, but he was dumb enough to fool around with the damn tractor. Me, I'll just look at it, whatever. Ignore it, it's not even there. But that kid, like a fool, played around with that thing and crushed him. He got his foot. Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry! You tried to help him, but this piece of shit let him die. It's nobody's fault. 
I wasn't strong enough. I'm sorry. If your girl is ever trapped, you better hope you get stronger. Or your friends aren't cowards. Please. Just go. Get out and never come back. Rock and hard place. You've got that ride to make it if you want it. See the The reason why I try to help the guy rather than the kid is that the guy can actually help. Unlike the kid, he's useless. Like he said, he's a dumb fuck. Well, the this guy, is as far as we're the going. The said it, he's a yeah, dumb fuck. He's not gonna be able to help, he's useless. Well, not useless, but he's not able to help as much as an adult. It's like comparing um, a freaking, a freaking, what? A plank of wood, which is the kid, to a bat. An aluminum bat, which is the guy. Look. Which one's more useful, the bat or the plank of wood? Hey there. As a weapon, Are you I'm saying. friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Dude, that's his arm. Fuck! Richard! Oh, you let him die. Who the hell is that? I don't know who that is, but close the damn door and lock it. We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let him right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? We have kids with us. I see one little girl. What is it? I... I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. I bet in a minute, you would. In a minute, in a minute Clem. Yeah, in a minute, in a minute. Just hold on They've for got now. kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. Yeah. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. She's an asshole, that's for sure. That's what it takes. Well, you don't have to be a bitch about it. Seriously. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. Oh, shit. Shit. We let one in, you stupid shit. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, mm. I'm cleaning him up. There's no fight. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop it! The fuck, seriously. What do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle him. We reasoned in with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. No. I thought I was reasoning with... Everyone chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut I thought I was siding with Kenny. I didn't think I was siding with the other guy. They will find us, and they will get in here. And none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. It's Larry, right? Man, this is his son. Look around, dumbass. I got a daughter in here. You got a daughter in here. Get your head out of your ass, boy. We've all got people in here. We can figure this out without killing anybody. There's another way. Yeah, with a shovel. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Key's behind the counter. Probably. Go for it, dude. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered yeah. in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, 
The first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! That little ship. Knock this guy out. Happily. Jesus! Oh, oh man. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say to kill him, but damn! <laughs> really bad timing because I have to end the episode. Well, guys, as you know, I made a mistake because I really wasn't paying attention before. So I thought I was siding with Kenny. I thought I was on Kenny's side, going like, fuck you, don't kill him. But no, I went on the wrong side. But, uh. Damn. Crazy as hell. It's getting really intense now. So I hope you guys are enjoying. Keep watching, stay tuned, because this shit's gonna get crazy. This shit's got nuts in it. Alright, so I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video. For more videos, click on the screen and visit my website for cool merchandise.